Hey everybody, it's Pastor Jonathan. It's Wednesday, the 30th of December, 2020. And I just wanted to fire out uh, a video to you as we're closing 2020 and entering into a new year, 2021. Uh, I know that for, for many of us, most of us, all of us, uh, 2020 was about the most bizarre year we've ever had, the most bizarre season we've ever experienced for so many reasons, certainly a season of great loss. For me personally, one of the hardest things of the season has been not gathering weekly for worship, seeing people, hugging people, talking to you all. Uh, I miss you. And I just want to say to you that uh, we're all in this together. I don't know when we're going to gather again in person for worship. I hope it's soon. Uh, and we will do so when we think it is safe and, and wise to do so, uh, physically safe to do so. Um, but I miss it. I'm thankful that we can have virtual worship services. I wish I knew when we were going to gather again in person. The Lord does know, and we believe he will guide us. So will you please pray uh, for your leaders at Grace and Peace that we will uh, walk in the ways of the Lord so we can therefore more easily understand and discern uh, God's will for us as a congregation. And will you also please join me in saying thank you to God for providing the resources that we have to put together virtual worship services, even uh, if, like me, you would prefer to be in person. Um, would you please say thank you that we can still gather for worship electronically, virtually, the way we're able to. I also want to say to you, um, some of you may have heard that our family, the Olson family, uh, had COVID. That is true. Uh, we did. We're, we're out of the, the hard part, which wasn't uh, terribly hard for us. A uh, few days per person down, a little bit of fever, dry coughs, uh, definite uh, fatigue uh, and soreness of body. And I personally haven't been able to, to taste or to smell anything uh, for 10 days or so. Um, and that could last a while, we'll see. But we've been spared from a lot of the physical suffering that people have experienced and are experiencing. And we're very thankful for that. We're particularly thankful that our youngest, Nathaniel, who's had a number of health issues and is immunocompromised, uh, had only about a 24 hour period, maybe not even that, where we had uh, concern for him. But I just wanted to get out in front of that for those of you who haven't heard, uh, or those of you that have, just to let you know that we are doing well, praise the Lord and uh, we are thankful for his grace in our family's life. Lastly, I wanna say praise to God and ask you to say praise to God, thanks to God with me. We're doing well financially as a church. So many institutions, churches in particular, are having a hard time in this COVID season. God has spared us from that. He's been very gracious to us. So I'm not begging you for, uh, for you to give at the end of the year. Having said that, if you would like to, you can get on our web page, uh, our website, uh, and you can give that way. You can scroll down to the description section below and you could give that way. And if you do so uh, before the end of the year, before the end of uh, tomorrow or whenever you're watching this, before the end of Thursday, it'll still count for 2020. And if you want to mail in a check to the church property, you can do so as well. Again, as long as it's postmarked um, by December 31st. 2020. Uh, it'll count for this year. I love you guys. I miss you. I know I've been saying that to you on a camera for, for months and months and months now. It is true. I do love you. I do pray for you, members of Grace and Peace. And I do, uh, I miss being with you. God willing, we'll get to do that soon. As we uh, close out a new year, as I close out this video, I wanted to read uh, the closing uh, of the Psalms, Psalm 150, the last Psalm of great praise to God. He is worthy. Praise the Lord, praise God in his sanctuary, praise him in his mighty heavens, praise him for his mighty deeds, praise him according to his excellent greatness, praise him with trumpet sound, praise him with lute and harp, praise him with tambourine and dance, Praise him with strings and pipe. Praise him with sounding cymbals. Praise him with loud clashing cymbals. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. 
and praise the Lord. God bless you. Be safe. And I hope that we'll get to connect soon. Bye-bye.